welcome back to my channel, new and returning subscribers. This is Margie from The Budget Evolution, where we do all things zero-based budgets, cash envelopes, and savings challenges. Today is a challenge day, and I'm really excited. This is from our first paycheck in April, and we are looking at $111. So let's count this real quick. So we have 20, 30, 40, uh, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. And then we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 111 dollars, whoops, 11 dollars towards challenges. Okay, so you're gonna see something a little different. I went through all of my binders and I separated it into sinking funds is our blue binder. So we have our life insurance, utilities authority, motor vehicles, prescriptions, memberships, and we are trying to get one month ahead on all of our bills. So I figured that that should be in our sinking funds. Then we, <clears throat> uh, let's start with high priority. High priority is all the savings challenges that we are trying to save for. So we are doing my daughter's graduation, our trip to Europe. It's our 25th wedding anniversary. Our emergency fund we are stockpiling for, Miss New Jersey tickets, my daughter's house. Uh, it was apartment and her and her roommate decided that they're going to rent a house instead. Actually a really cute three bedroom house. Uh, for the last couple years of school. Um, this is for car maintenance. We moved our crews in here. We moved renovations in here, 52 week challenge and Christmas. And then these are all of our trackers that we just did. And these trackers are what I'm using to, um, so we know how much we put placeholders in and in our Capital One savings, high yield savings account. So that takes care of our high priority. Our low priority, I decided to come up with a couple more um, categories that I knew that we kind of need money for. It's not something we need money for on a daily basis or even a monthly basis, but sometimes it's nice to have a, a few dollars set aside for you know stuff like budget supplies and what i mean by budget supplies i'm talking like games envelopes binders you know that kind of stuff uh clothes i moved into low priority crafts because i loved craft um, i have a garden i have my house garden i also have a vegetable garden which we're actually not going to do the vegetable garden this year since we're spending so much time away I moved from our sinking funds gifts because this is a more lower priority envelope. Holidays, I also moved into here um, because again, it's not a high priority thing. We don't have to do these things. It's not something that has to come out of our uh, paycheck every month. Um, outdoor, you know, it's just like outdoor maintenance on the house, the yard, whatever it may be. Self-care, I realized that my cash wallet has a beauty envelope, but I never stuff it. <laughs> so I figured, well, you know what? Maybe it's time to start stuffing an envelope for those kinds of items. Um, it could be, you know, moisturizer, it could be eyeshadow, anything like that. I cut my own hair, so I'm not worried about a hairdresser. And YouTube. Um, this I haven't decided yet what I'm going to use this for, but I have a feeling I'm going to start saving money for different milestones that we get. If we did, I had to get it off the floor. If we try to start tracking our monetizations. Um, so I pulled this off of here to their journey and printed it out. And each TV box is 40 hours of watch time and each subscribe box is 
10 subscribers. So I think I'm gonna start tracking this. I just finally figured out how to look at all of my numbers um, from the time that I started up until like today. So before I could only see 28 days, <laughs> I had a hard time figuring it out, but I figured it out and we are gonna start um, tracking this. And I think I'm gonna set a dollar amount for each of these. I haven't figured out though how many dollars and then when we reach certain milestones, then I'm gonna do a giveaway because you are part of the community. You are the ones who are watching my videos you're the one who's going to make me reach these goals. So I want to give back to my community. So we're going to set that aside. We're going to set this aside. And we counted our money already. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to do, we're going to play B for T. This is from Two Sister Bs. And this is for our graduation envelope. Um, and I did ask my daughter what she named her frog. And she said her frog's name is Bayou Bob. Isn't that cute? So Bayou Bob is gonna start at the starting line here and we are going to roll our casino dice from the Taj Mahal that is no longer, the Taj Mahal is now the Hard Rock Casino. So let's roll and see how much we can save. We have eight, so we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight is a flower, and flowers are five dollars. Let's roll again. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we have a dollar and a honey pot. So a dollar. I'll take a dollar out. And the honey pot, we're supposed to roll our dice and then add that amount. Seven. So we got five, six, seven. Let's roll again. That's five. One, two, three, four, five is a dollar. Try again. Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine is twenty dollars. So let's see what we're up to. We've got we have twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four. Four. Should we do one more? Let's do one more. I know I'm gonna probably 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nope, we went off the page anyway. So we're gonna let Bayou Bob take a break. We're gonna set this aside. And this is high priority because my daughter's graduation is coming up in the next month. I'm so excited. She had her um, graduation pictures done. I can't wait to see these photos. They did it all over campus. We are now tracking our money. Oh, let's see, what did I say we have? 34, $34. So today is, oh my gosh, what is today? I think today's the eighth and we are adding 34. $34, that's six, six, two, sixty-six. We should have in our B for T envelope. So we have 100, 200, 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 61, two, three, four, five, six. 266 in graduation. Now my daughter just told me we needed like $280, $90 for her graduation party. That's for three people, three adults, um, to do this fun graduation thing. It's I think it's on a trolley, uh, no, a, a railroad car or something by the stadium where um, they do the football games. So it'll be interesting. It'll be, it'll be a lot of fun. So we're gonna set that aside. Uh, let's play Queen Bee of Hearts. Okay, so this one you need playing cards. This is also from Two Sister Bees. I love their games. They're so much fun. So let's uh, shuffle our cards. If you're hearing strange noises in the background, I'm not sure if you can hear that. My husband is finally um, fixing our master bath toilet, which was starting to leak. We've been in the house 20, um, 
25 years. So yes, things are gonna start to break down and that's why we also have an envelope for renovation. So we have diamonds. Diamonds are three spaces. So we start here and we go one, two, three. So that's three dollars. Oh, no, that's right, no dice this one. Clubs are two spaces, so that's two dollars. So we'll make this a five. And the next one is a spade. Spades are one space, so that's three dollars. Two, three, and let's pull another one. Clubs are two spaces. Make honey for tea, bees not feeling well, two dollars. So we'll take another five. And I think we're good. So why don't we stop playing this one? We'll put that away and we will put this in for cruise. Yep, nope, wrong one. See, now I'm not gonna remember which uh, envelope, uh, which binders they're in because it's all new. So let's see, cruise is here. Just so you know, I've tried, this is my third attempt I'm making this video. The first one, I, I'm not, I don't even remember what happened. It didn't work. And then now this one, uh, the last one after, just before this one, I, um, what did we have? $10? I, the video, it went to slow motion. So I guess when I went, I must have hit the thing and I went to fix it and because now I have it um, playing on an iPad off to the side so I can see what I'm doing. So we took out $327 to pay for the balance on our cruise. So we are going to take that away. So that's going to be $105 left that we owe ourselves. That eventually we'll put in the book. And right now this is a little messed up because of all the mistakes we've made. <laughs> So we will put that aside. Okay, so what else should we be saving for? Um, uh, let's see, what should we play? I wanna play a game, but the Sweet Treats. See, I have this game, Sweet Treats. I can't remember what we were playing for. Oh, Europe, oh, there you go, see? It says it, I'm glad I wrote it down. So we'll put this one to the side. Whoops, uh-oh, see? I keep hitting my camera stand. I ordered a new camera stand that's not gonna sit on the table. This one sits on the table and kind of sits over the table. So um, I'm getting a new one that's not gonna be on the table. It just kind of will hover over. So we'll see how well that works. So we're gonna put Bayou Bob at the beginning here. We're gonna roll the dice and we've got eight. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh my God, I can't do, you know, the last time I played this, I hit the same one. I don't have that kind of money. So guess what? We're gonna start over. <laughs> we don't have all that kind of money. Seven, that's better. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Fifteen dollars. I think we can do fifteen dollars. So one, two, three, four, five. Good. All right, we got it. We got it. We got to stay away from them lollipops. All right, so we can cross this one out. And we've got, was that four? One, two, three, four is five dollars. So we can put this back and take a 10. Let's roll one more time. So we got seven, All right, cross this out. And we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's five dollars. One, two, three, four, five. Should we go one more try? Let's do one more. Listen, if we land on something that we can't afford, then, you know, we can always skip it. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Five dollars. Oh, awesome. I like this one. <laughs> so we can take a 10 for that one and put five back. I think that's good for this game. We'll put this in our oh, I keep. You know what? I'm gonna move this like this. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. So we saved $30 for Europe. 
we're gonna go in here. We're gonna update our tracker. Oh, and our Rome trip got canceled. I'm so upset. This is on our cruise. We stop in Rome and we paid, we put it in the bank. Well, no, we took it at, no. We put it, we were going to put it in the bank and then I found out it got canceled and I was so upset and I'm like, ah, oh. so we put it back in and this is $30. So now we have 575. 575. And then let's put this oops in here. So now we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 450, 470, 490, 510, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75. So 575, right? 575. And we do have a tracker from Jordan Budgets. And this got messed up. I'll worry about that later. I'll have to fix it. We'll track it later. So what else should we do? Um, my daughter's house is coming up. She just started buying stuff for her house. So why don't we do that? Why don't we try to set some money aside for that? Let's get this stuff out of the way. You know what? Let's play Shut the Box. And we're doing pretty good on Shut the Box. Uh, let's see. We need dice. We don't need Bayou Bob. I'm gonna put that out of the way. Let's see if we can shut the box. Well, if I shut the box, I've got to save $20. <laughs> so we've got a four. And we are going to cross out four. This game is from Reinventing Renee. Thank you, Renee. Seven. Six. Whoops, wrong side. Two. Five. You, is everybody enjoying their weather? I mean, our weather is starting to get more seasonably warm. Just two days ago, it was like 80 degrees. Uh-oh. <laughs> So that's 17, 18, 19, 20, $21, $21 we are putting towards my daughter's apartment. So let's put this to the side and we are going to make this green. That's one of the reasons why it's hard when you get snake eyes, because if you get it again, guess what? Your game is done. Okay, I'm gonna have to print out a new shut the box card so we can play another time. So we'll put that away. And we are putting this in Jay's apartment. Jay house, not apartment, house. Hopefully they, they just submitted all of their um, paperwork. So hopefully they get approved. I mean, they should. I don't see a reason why they shouldn't. How much did I say I put in there? Uh-oh. Well, I guess I'll find out. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500. Well, something's not right. 500, because I didn't put all that in there. Um, let's see, this was 368 plus 132. Well, that says 500, and all this money is in there. I, mean, I must have not tracked something. So it's 500, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71. So 571. I guess we'll just put $71. So it's 571. That's not what we originally put in today, but apparently I added something up wrong, <laughs> which happens. Okay, we'll put that away. And let's see, we've got 10, 11, 12. We've got $16 left. 
We already did cruise. Rano, I'm not really worried about since my husband's doing the toilet. Um, hmm. Ice cream run. We can play this. And we can also do save or spend, but we're gonna do ice cream run. We'll get Bayou Bob out, right? He comes out and he's gonna play. We're gonna roll the dice. And whatever we land on is gonna be in the first envelope. How's that sound? <laughs> or you know what? Why don't we, how many envelopes do I have? I've seen this in a couple of other videos where you take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have eight envelopes. Well, the last two are kind of really low priority. So why don't we just do six? And we will just roll one dice and that'll tell us what envelope we're doing. We're doing number five. So we're doing one, two, three, four, five is gifts. So we're putting in for gifts. Let's roll the dice. Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Really? Really? <laughs> I don't have $20. Oh, okay. So we are now going to owe the game um, $4 because we only have $16. i am going to take out a little note. Oh. Four dollars, and this is going to go in gifts. And blue. So the today's, I think it's the eighth. I don't even know anymore. <laughs> so we are going to add twenty dollars. We are supposed to have 20, so that's 208 in gifts. So we now have 50, 150, 150, 170, 180, 190, 195, 96, 97, 98, 99, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, plus 4. Well, that didn't add up right. I had, oh, now I don't know what I had. Oh, well, it was 188, so 120. That's 50, 60, 70, 80, 8, 5, 1, 2, 3. We put in 10, 11, 12, 15, 16. Oh, we put in 16, so we only owe $4. Okay, I see what we did. So it is 20 but we only owe it four. Where did I put my note? Hello? Oh, there it is. Oh, that's right. I don't, you know, I don't know. 20, right? Two, 10. I'll figure it out. <laughs> why is it so difficult? I don't understand why this is so difficult. It's not supposed to be so hard. I mean, we should be able to add and subtract, right? So I'll figure it out later. You guys are all probably laughing at me going, oh my God, Margaret, you are just doing it like <laughs> stupid backwards. <laughs> so there we go. We're out of money. And that is the end of, oh, where did this come from? <laughs> just one of those days, isn't it? I want to thank you all. Thank you so much for coming and watching my video. I hope you had as much fun as I just did. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye, everybody.